What's going on, everybody? How y'all feel? You tune in to another episode of Mail Translations with your host, Clarence Brown. Got a couple friends with me tonight. Uh, we're going to be discussing a few topics, um, and I got the ladies to, to advocate for the women. And I got my brother here, Pastor Doja. He's going to be advocating for the men with me. So um, the first thing I wanted to talk about and what we're going to discuss right off the bat is dating older versus young. And that's for the men, dating older women versus younger women. And for the ladies here, dating older men versus younger men. So I wanted to hear what y'all ladies have to say when it comes to dating older versus younger. Now, I know Dominique can put you on the spot because <laughs> you said there are some perks to dating. What was it, younger or was it? It's, it's perks to dating both older and younger. And then you were talking about the old man to turn you out if you ain't got your head on. I'm like, man. So, I mean, what, 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 where all that come from? Why you, got, why you had those, those views on younger and older men? Sometimes older men tend to get with younger men because they, they think that, I'm sorry, older. <laughs> well, they have oh, the wow. same time. But no, um, older men get with younger women because younger women are more palatable. They're, they can be mushed into whatever. They Molded can mold and them. Yeah, and manipulate them. Exactly. They can be manipulated into doing pretty much anything, especially because they're young, they're naive. And some men take advantage of that. Um, you know, they take advantage of their youthfulness. They take advantage of their sexual drive, and they turn them into me. yeah, they turn into little animals. Oh man, is that right? But yeah. So what about the older? I mean, what about the younger men then? Younger men. Um, let me say, the perk of dating a younger man, they have. Uh, how can I say? More energy. More energy. <laughs> they are able to go to different places and do things that older men just can't do. Now, for some reason, I just feel like that's all sexual when you smile on like that. Like, oh, <laughs> like, oh, the older man can't go to uh, No, I don't know about that. No, it, uh, on a sexual note, uh, you don't have to worry about, baby, go get me a sandwich and come back and he's sleep. Younger man, they be ready to go for round two. I be like, dang, I just put in 30, 40 minutes, but no. Uh, <laughs> I mean, no, it's the, you know, um, and yeah, well, the the downside of younger men is they don't they like passion that older men have learned throughout, you know, their experience. And you know, some young men don't have the experience. So, like I say, it's perks to both. Right, right. And uh, okay, uh, all right. <laughs> now, it's 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 some of the similar views when it comes to women, right? And women and dating um, from a man's perspective, at least from mine, dating older women. Now, although they may be more experienced, sometimes it tends to happen where they, they talk down on you or they don't treat you with the same respect that a woman that's the same age or maybe younger mm -hmm. might treat you with. Mm -hmm. So sometimes, I mean, in my own opinion, I feel like dating an older woman, it, it's, it's some drawbacks and there's some perks. You know, the perks being is more experienced on, on certain areas, but at the same time, you know, you, you have to deal with that lack of respect too. And then when you date a younger woman, it's, it's, to me, I feel like sometimes it's a level of indecisiveness that men have problems with. Me, personally, right. that, that was something that I had issue with when I was dating women that were younger than myself. So, that's just me. I want to hear past what you got. You, you ever dated anyone <coughs> younger or older? What, what? I, I had both. Um, when you're young, and you dating an older woman, she got a good job. She ain't doing half the house no more. <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, she 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 just more stable, and so um, it's the side of a guy, you know, they call him Coopers now, but it's the side of a young man who feels like I got an older woman. It brings a certain level of confidence to a young man because he felt like he pulled the older woman. Yeah, true. So, true but true. but the other side, the older woman, she has a side of her that mamas you. You know what I mean? Because um, she's a natural nurturer at that age and stage of life. She cares. She you know, call me, let me know you're all right, baby. When you dating girl 25, y'all don't talk to each other. If you made it home, <laughs> none of that stuff matters. Like so she gives you a different perspective on life. I think the distance is just the maturity level. And usually the older woman, it just, it takes a course. She's got over her high, and it never really works out on that end. Now, dating a younger woman, when you're a guy, um, I, I kind of agree with uh, Dominique um, that, that it, it does make you, you think you can mold her and make her. The only problem is because she's young, she's molded and makeable. She's molded and makeable for any guy. She's open with every day. And, you know, and so sometimes that's not, that's not, uh, 
especially in this particular generation now, I don't know if that's the best decision because um, the maturity level is so different. Some girl at 18, she, she, she head strong and she got a good head on her shoulder. And you can change certain things about it, but other things you can't. You know what I mean? So, but I feel like this. I feel like sometimes the the younger woman, once she get with the older man, it's that same sense of pride. That it's like, okay, well, you know, I got a man that's older instead of just dealing right. with the guys in the, in the age range right. that you that that you are. So, I don't think it's looked down upon as much as it used to be. Back in the day, like girl, that girl, that boy, the man can be your daddy. Now it's almost like I got me a young one, and she like. You know, I got me a man. He, I'm mature for my age. He telling me that. <laughs> you know, all that you know I, mean? I just think that in time, you'll start seeing the distance. When she goes from being a young girl from 20 to 30 is a jump. And your dude was 35 when you met him. Now he 50 and you 30, 35. And the game changed. You know what I mean? And so I always tell people, they're cool little cute little relationships, but, you know, time will tell, you know, situations like that. Do you think that it, ladies, y'all feel like they work? Lot, uh, more times than not when it's uh, uh, age difference or uh, disparity? I think with women, with the older men, it works better because women mature faster than men. Okay. And especially if the older man is setting the tone of the relationship, it is bidding, benefiting the woman, especially if he's a provider, uh, you know, he's on point in his career and he gets with her, she's going to stay, you know, and go through the the changes for the most part if he's doing everything that he's supposed to do and he's you know not stepping out or anything like that I believe it'll work better but with a younger man and an older woman he what's gonna happen I've seen this time and time again the older woman is gonna start bringing him to the status that she want him at so she's gonna get him a nice car he's gonna start looking good and then He's gonna go stunt with his homies, and he's gonna start cheating, stepping out because he feel like he at this, you know, he's at a high yeah. state. And the older one was like, "Hold on, just like um, thin line between love and hate." Uh -huh. She put him on, and he was like, "Oh." Yeah, he, yeah, he and that that happens. I see that happen time and time again. But I think it works better with older men and a younger woman versus the older woman and a younger man. You think so? Cause I totally disagree with you. Oh, please, please <laughs> tell me. Tell I, think, me. I think I think what happens is. Uh, all you do is raise a a generation of women who get dependent on the guy, and I, I I'm just anti it because I see so many women like I got me a good dude and he a good dude only because he provide this and this and this and she's still going back to Craig. <laughs> Come with that. Cause, cause, cause Craig, <laughs> Craig, like she says, more than Jay does more stuff because other guy you know he takes care, of, make sure she got something to eat, make sure she good, you know. He likes sex, but he may not want it as much as she does from a drive perspective. But she's happy because she's taken care of. You know what I mean? And that's a benefit for a lot of women. Um, and no matter how old school that sounds, I think women still want the security of knowing that she has a man that can provide for her. This mm -hmm. and, this. Yeah. and when you and when you date guys your age, a lot of times because of women, whether it's true or not, sometimes mature more than right. quicker than men. Um, you know what I mean? It, it, it works out like that because the other guy, he didn't think about a job until he get 30. Yeah. I'm not saying he does, but I'm just saying that. In certain situations like that. <laughs> All right. So. Now, I feel like this. Now, I've dated women that were older than me, and throughout the whole time when we were dating, I'm telling myself, this ain't never going to work. Now, we might have been together for a period of time, but in, my, in the back of my mind, I'm like, nah, she, she's way too old. Ultimately, this is not going to work out just because of, I don't know, it's just, I don't know if it's, um, the way it's viewed on the outside of how people perceive the relationship and whatnot. But to me, I just feel like it just looks weird. Like, okay, you go to church with this woman, she got her kids, and you looking like one of her sons. <laughs> now, you might be proud like that, you know? I think it comes down to, I mean, I don't know what the it age, I don't know what the age, I don't know what the age is. I think seven years, maybe, right. is about a good cut the line off. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because... And I'm not anti. I have some people. I know some people in the ministry. I know a pastor right now. He's, he's you know, he's 20 years older than his, than his uh, uh, wife. I have a cousin. Her husband is like 30 years older. You saw. Yeah, and so my point is that. that it just depends on the person. It's and I think it comes down to what works for you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, unfortunately, that's, that's what it um, if it works for you, I mean, it'd be different for me. I don't want anybody to mix me up with be one of your children. Yeah. <laughs> you, know I mean? you know what I mean? But I, I think I think that's, I think you just putting a lot of more strain on a relationship because it comes down to how people view it. Just like in any relationships, you know, it comes down to the confidence and maturity level that two people have because 
if you cool with having somebody look like your daddy with you and know that's what everybody gonna say, you know what I mean? And so be it. Ain't cool with it. I personally ain't ain't going. I can't do it. I'm gonna be gonna see it like, you know, hey, that's, that's, is that your mama? Right. Oh, that's your girl. You know? I don't wanna be with a black Santa Claus. Right. I actually would prefer an older guy. Like older what? like how many ages? What's right. the age limit? I don't have, you can't be like 70 or anything, 60, but I was I mature as long as 15 years old, you was good? 20 years? I'm 30, so. Uh, 45? About 10, 15, yeah. 45 is good? Mm-hmm. Yes, 45 is good. Because and that's your uncle. That's your uncle. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't want to look at it in that way, but. Are I you okay if people looking at it that way? That's, that's fine, because I know if you're with me, I, I have certain requirements, and you have to, you know, Dress a, not dress a certain way, but look a certain way. You ain't gonna be like with suspenders on or something. No, <laughs> well, it won't work out that way. But what if he just looks. It's I have, if, as long, if I'm attracted to you on the intellectual side and also the sexual side, people won't say much about that. But in age, I'm cool with it. You can so be you're 45, 45 and doing this thing. Hey, I don't see some like forty-five-year-old guys that I'm like you forty-five, and you know black don't crack. So you forty-five for a black man, then you can be look thirty. So I'm cool yeah. with that. So. See, I feel like it's all how you look at that age. See, you might say yes. ten, fifteen years now. If he got grades all I over, I like right here, well, especially if it's in a beard. Yes, all over. Keep no, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's all over. It's a bad job. He could be 45, but if he look like he's 50, then you're right. Like, yeah. But if he's 45, he look like Idris. Well, my, my question is, exactly. physical attraction has it's to be there. She said but, they but, like 50. But what if it's only here today? You still want physical attraction at 35. And it's got to be. No, no, no. I don't. If physical, I have to have some type of chemistry with you. I'm sorry. Physical, and of course, physical has to be there. But no, once that's established, because you, once you get past the looks, you're going for the core, you right. know, and, and women, I, I believe women are like that once, you know, we're attracted to you and it's your attributes that make us stay with you because you can be a fine guy and don't have a job and the, like you said, the, it'll wear off, right. but if you're, you look good, you have your stuff together, you could be 45 years old and I will get past the looks because you're seeing that person every day, it's going to start looking normal. But I agree with you. My only question is, what are you gonna do about these trips to the doctor? Cause he's he got doctor. <laughs> look, look at you. you gotta call Mad Taxi or somebody to come pick you up. I got things to do. Oh, but, no, but yeah, no, we're gonna no. take care of you. you but no, women, I'm, uh, women like your Medicaid tax. That's why. Um, I, and I see a lot more now. A lot of older men are starting getting younger women because they want them to take care of them as long as they provide the money and all that other stuff. And some people are cool with that. I'm not cool with it as long as you're established. You can't be like halfway in the grave, no. All right, now listen, I'm going to pose this question because I see a lot of women and they hate on fellas that date a younger woman. Now, see, let's say the guy 45 and his Got him a nice 20 20 year old. Yeah, they're like, oh, he ain't, what he doing with that young guy? What he he, he ought to be shaming himself. Yeah. That ought to be against the law. He time. wrong for that. Don't he it? is. Why? Because his he is. What about her manipulating him? Mm-hmm. Taking his old self up for taking advantage he know of him. He she knows know he old. Really. He knows know he can't do a whole lot. He knows what's going on. He's 45. He can do a whole lot. I ain't so. saying she's a gold dude. Yeah. But she ain't messing with that. And I and understand. He established and he might have had his career on point. She young. And she's she taking advantage of him. Exactly. He lonely. He old. Mm-hmm. He just got out of marriage. <laughs> now he wants something fresh. Now he done took the old one back and got a new brand. A new that's so it. all the women they look at that negatively. They like ah oh, look look look. But look. if you if it depends wow, on the person. Married, so. It depends because <laughs> let let's say for example, let's just throw out Hugh Hefner. This guy is like 70, 80 years old, and he purposely go out to get younger women because he has a one. He has an image to maintain. A lot of men who do that they want trophy wives. They want girls who look good and make them look good because of their crisis, whatever they're going through. And I, I think that's wrong. And that's why people look down on them because they are using that person as a piece of whether you know, and not taking them as a right. as a being, you know. And and then they're once they. You know, they find something else, a new toy to play with. That girl is all messed up in the head now. She's like 25 years old. He probably done popped in with a few babies. Nah, and see, he going on to something I younger. feel like this is for women, it's okay to date an older man. Mm-hmm. But also for women, it's not okay for that older man to date a younger woman. Because there are motives behind it. Ah, see? see I have, it's I, motives I, either I, way. That's why I want to talk about what is it. it what, like, have, have you seen a successful 
older man and a younger woman last? Uh, what do you mean by older? What, how many years? Give me some. The, uh, let's see. Well, you know, 10 is around the average nowadays. Mm-hmm. But let's say 15, 20 years older. Have you seen an a older, older guy? Let's say a 25 year old girl with a 45, 40 year old man. Soon later, soon later, here's what happens the woman starts doing her own thing. She wants to be, she doesn't want to be homebound because the guy 50, he wants somebody to watch TV with a little bit. Yeah. And, you know, and candles, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, he, he lighting candles again. And, you know what I mean? And so she still want to have sex on the car. And, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, I mean, really, I mean, seriously, she, she trying to bring out, she trying to bring out the caramel and the hot fudge. And dude is saying, my back hurt and, you know, I want you, but. You know what I mean? So I, I think that's what I'm saying. I always think the longevity of it is different because I think the woman's just as wrong. This guy's at the tail end of his life. He got children as older than you. All his kids hate you. So, so, so when we come around to Christmas, you and her, y'all look alike. And, and he's trying to say, this is like your stepmom now. You know, just just love her anyway. It just I think it puts too much strain on a relationship. You know, everybody, anyone that really comes down to it, both of you got the wrong motives. There's no way a girl dreams of saying, when I turn 25, I don't want an old man. Nobody dreams yeah. of that. Yeah. And old men, we, of course, when old men go through crisis, you're right, they go back to old toys, younger women, sports cars. I know a guy right now, he's 58 years old. Now he want an earring and a tattoo. Oh, my God. <laughs> and he's going to go get but you young know, you know what I mean? But it's just, sometimes men, when we go through our real struggles, we go back to old toys. I just think it's better to grow up together. But, you know, I ain't to work for you. You know, I'm going, you know, I'm, I'm happy for you, but I just, I don't know. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, I just, I don't know. I just feel like it, it's, somebody got to get the medicine and, <laughs> you know, somebody got to make some doctor's appointment. I ain't going to AARP to pick up nothing. See what I'm saying? All right. Well, y'all let us know how y'all feel. Viewers, y'all have to chime in, like, comment, share. How, how do y'all feel about dating older women, younger women, fellas? What is it? Women? Do y'all prefer a younger man or older man? Y'all have to y'all have to put y'all commentary in. So let us know, man. It's Clarence Brown Male Translations. I have a couple friends here just tuning in, um, chiming in and on some topics. But we need to hear how y'all feel. So lead those and we'll see y'all next week, man.